About a month or two ago, one of our Uma Angels, Tony, reached out to us with an unbelievable opportunity. Seriously, we didn't believe it at first. Tony felt a certain connection to us in our story and probably noticed how bad at diving we already were. So, he invited us to spend two weeks at his dive shop in Cozumel to teach us the ins and outs of diving and get us open water certified. It was an offer we couldn't believe, but one we couldn't refuse. Welcome to Kienha. And the to stay. We stayed at the Scuba Tony guest house, a super cozy apartment, and it didn't take us long to unpack all of our belongings and get comfortable. Living on Uma, we're no longer used to such a large bed. So we had a hard time staying in one single spot. Tony, give us an awesome little welcome present to the Kinha. And we have a blender here, so we're going to make some smoothies. This island is so nice and welcoming that they decided to throw Din and I a super huge welcome party. No idea we were that famous. Or it might just be the fact that we were here for carnival.
Good morning, people. So, it's 6 o'clock in the morning. We just woke up, and we're going to go diving in about an hour. So... Because we will be here for two weeks, Tony let us use his scooter during our stay, which made it much easier to travel around the island. We spent the first hour learning about our equipment, and after a brief introduction, it was time to go under. Normally here in Cozumel, even the confined water is done in the ocean, but because there was a northern wind blowing down the west coast, we had to search the island for a pool. After we practiced the basics a few times and got a feel for being underwater, it was time to go and finally get salty. So we are on our way to our first open water dive. We're going scuba, scuba diving today. And Not it's in the pool. Which and awesome. it's my birthday. Ouch. Go babe. It's gonna be an awesome, awesome day. I'm excited. Today is your open water training. It was such an amazing feeling to be breathing underwater. We took the time to learn all the necessary skills. And once we felt comfortable enough, it was time for some fun. If there's something that you wanna know, oh, oh. If there's something, show me where to go, oh, oh. And I will give myself to you, I will give myself to you, oh. Ooh. 
After all that diving, we were tired. But we were not done celebrating yet. Like I said before, it was my birthday. Cheers! <laughs> Yep, what's a birthday without the most awesomely epic nacho birthday cake? We spent the next couple of days finishing our open water training and all we had left to take was the written test. It's not every day that you get to take an exam with a nice glass of red wine. Thanks Tony. Now we can officially call ourselves PADI certified open water divers. The best part of it all, we have another 10 days to practice our newly acquired skills. We are so excited to share the rest of this beautiful experience with you, but until then, cheers! We've got some diving to do now. Scuba doo ba doo, where are you? We've got some diving to do now. Shark or ray or fish, I see you. I want to snorkel around. <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do it. <laughs>